Hi, it's Di. Welcome, and we have some very, very special guests today. My whole entire upline and even a little bit of downline. <laughs> so you're going to hear from us today, and you're going to hear some wonderful tips to help you figure out how you're going to have your own success line and your own upline, and we're going to start with Patricia. Thank you. I'm Patricia Hawkinson, Regional Vice President with Argonne, and I said, and it's true, in this case it's age before beauty because I'm the oldest of the team and the low person on the totem pole this morning, but that's okay, that's fine with me. We're each going to talk to you a little bit about our journey and what has made it so special for us. There are two things I'd like to say to you. Personal development and personal growth. This is so important. This is a company, our president will say, it's a health and wellness company. Oh no, it's a personal development company disguised as a health and wellness company. And I have found that to be the case. You grow beyond your imagination. You learn and you develop and you become a whole new and better person. The other thing that I think has made a huge difference for me and will for you is belief. It's so true. You need to believe in yourself, first of all. You need to believe in the industry. And you need to believe in this wonderful company and our products. That belief will make a huge difference in your ability to talk to others and encourage them on this wonderful journey we call our one. And now I'm going to pass it to Diane. And I am officially Diane During Zek, Executive Regional Vice President. And the thing that has helped me the most in reaching the level of success so far are the Learn and Burns. I'm known as the Learn and Burn Queen. I listen to one every single solitary day while I'm putting my makeup on. And Zig Ziglar says motivation is like taking a bath. It wears off every day. So I think this is something you can do every day. And as you're listening to these Learn and Burns, I want you to remember too, and our President Rita Davenport says this, God gave us two ears and one mouth so we can listen twice as much. And you're going to be more successful in your business if you listen to your customers twice as much. Sharon? Hi, my name is Sharon Murphan, and I'm in qualifications for National Vice President. And um, my story is a little bit different. I like to keep things really simple and really fun. And I have four little children, so my biggest key to success is to be simple, to be fun, to be real, and simply don't quit. A lot of people, I think, quit before payday. This is a game of persistence, and you just keep going, and one day, you'll just start seeing all the benefits and it'll start rolling. Um, so just my tip is to just keep going, whether you have a slow start, I know you'll have a strong finish if you continue on the journey. My name is Kathy Britton, I'm National Vice President, and I have two things I wanna to mention to you. First of all, you gotta be all in. You can't just start this business and wanna put one foot in or put your big toe in and see how it works. What I did from the get-go when Barbara introduced me to Arbonne was I made a decision. I'm going to do this and I'm jumping off a cliff and I'm going to be all in with my business. So I want to encourage you to be all in, fully committed to building your Arbonne business, but also consistent activity. And I know that's nothing new to any of you. You hear this over and over, especially if you listen to Learn and Burns like Di was talking about. Consistent activity is huge when it comes to this business. It doesn't matter what your outreach method is, you've got to be seeing the people and talking to the people. And that will help you be successful in your Arbonne business. Barbara? Hi, I'm Barbara Beatty, Executive National Vice President. I'm the leader of the clan. <laughs> the great grandma. <laughs> and really, honestly, there is no key to success. The most important thing is you have to know that you have exactly what it takes to be at the top of this company. I've always felt that it doesn't matter how much you know, and people don't really care how much you know. They only know how, want to know how much you care about them. And they won't remember really too much of what you said at the end of the presentation, but they will remember exactly what they felt when they walked away. So I would say one of the keys to success is loving and caring about people. If they feel that you truly love them and care about them, they'll be attracted to you and they'll be attracted to Arbonne. Diane. Thank you, and I want to thank everybody. And the, the one thing that we all have in common is that we all have a white Mercedes. And so we hope that today that these few little tips you heard will help you get your white Mercedes. Thanks a lot.